Well, it looks like Dad got himself a brand new TV. I can't wait to never see it again in this giant black hole of a house. Oh yeah, the old TV was broken. So maybe I can hide my test in it, and then when it gets taken out to the dump, I'll be rid of the evidence. Or not. I, I guess the screen cracked when Mom tried to hide her fat ass behind it. What's up guys, welcome back to Hide My Test, where I failed so bad, the teacher made me take an eye exam just to make sure that I wasn't blind. Little did he realize, I just didn't expect there to be numbers on that math exam. And now, I think my mom is busy drawing up some kind of treasure map, that way she can later retrieve the foot that she's about to bury in my ass. Once again, we need to get rid of this evidence right now, which is a whole lot easier said than done, because the second I hide this thing, Mom is going to come flying in here like some kind of failure-seeking missile with a lock on, and then find it. Like, I still don't understand how she does it, whether it be genetic or magic, but she just knows these things, which means if we want to fool her, we're going to have to come up with some plans that are really far outside of the box such as making an offering to the statue of Danny DeVito. Come on, you little Judas, help me out. Well, the drawer is locked, and I can tell you right now, there are not enough ass beatings in the world to make me touch my parents' beds. Like, I have enough siblings to know that if you turned on a blacklight, that thing would look like a Roman Pollock painting. So hopefully there will be some less sticky options over here for us. I'd imagine we'll be able to find a limp coat rack. Don't see how that's at all helpful. <laughs> okay, now I'm kind of panicking. Oh, okay, I like this. Uh, oh. Are we good? I think we're good. <laughs> Do you see what I mean though? She came in, she caught the scent. She knew exactly where it was, but she didn't find it because she doesn't know about dad's little special hidey hole. You know, it's where he goes to escape mom when he's being treated like a turkey baster. Well, look at the rest of my happy little family all hanging out together as I run for my life. <laughs> I don't think I really want to try hiding it underneath this rug, because I don't really want to touch it, considering two of the three of them are probably peeing into it as we speak. I don't suppose I can get myself a box of marbles? Balls or something like that? Okay. Well, we've also got a pedestal. Should I put you here for some reason? Oh, I see. We can set up a bit of a trap. We can home alone, Mom. I like it. So if we put this here, then I don't want to bait the trap with my own ass. That is a mistake. I mean, it's really only a temporary solution at best. We've pissed her off. Now she's just gonna go out and buy all-terrain slippers. What are the chances she broke her hip and won't be chasing me around today? Like, I know that's only gonna make things worse for me when she does manage to catch me, but I could still really use a day off. What are you doing, Grandpa? Just hanging out in the kitchen? Nobody making you food, of course, because I'm the caretaker around here. I've got what I can only assume is a funny little weed baggie. <laughs> Did you want some of this? Fix up your glaucoma? No? Okay, maybe I can, uh... Alright. I have made you a meal! You don't get a bowl, though. You could just put it on your head. Oh! Grandpa's working on his old Greg cosplay! <laughs> sure, why not? I'm just gonna soak this test. Or, or burn it, maybe? Do you want to take it? Perfect. I like it. Oh, Mom is still up and at him. But she doesn't figure it out. Okay, Grandpa, have you drank Baileys from a shoe? I'm sure most of you guys have picked up on this already, but I'm willing to bet there are quite a few that don't really realize that this house isn't like a normal house. It's not really segmented up into rooms or furnished. It's kind of like a giant empty warehouse with very little stuff littered about. So whenever you get to interact with a front door, that's a cause for celebration. Like Halloween celebration. You guys get to go trick-or-treating and I get to run around scared for my life. 
don't suppose you could do me a favor and take this with you? No, of course not. Well, I've got myself some bug spray. Don't suppose I can convince you two to get off my damn lawn? No, okay then. Oh, I need to help Dad. He's freaking out because there's a poop beetle next to him. All right, well, suck it, poop beetle. I saved you, Dad! Now save me? Oh, come on. <laughs> Help me out here. I, I can probably, like... Oh. Oh, no, no, no. Don't tell me I'm gonna give the kids a poop candy. <laughs> oh, it's gone! There's no way she can find it. Another parent may, though. I'm just gonna throw it out there right now. If my dad put as much effort into helping me with my homework as he does putting on magic shows for the lawn hobos, my brother, and my gym teacher, then maybe I wouldn't fail all of these friggin' tests. <laughs> this is my parents' fault. What are you up to, Grandpa? Just hanging out with your pet vase, I suppose? I'm, I'm gonna put on the kettle if you want some. Now this is, uh, mine. Oh, I did not think I was gonna murder his pet face. <laughs> that could be a problem. I got a piece of it. Can I blame the test? No. Should I boil the test? No, okay, it's gotta be something to do with dad. Why don't you pull this out of your ass? Oh, 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 grandpa's pissed. He's on the warpath. <laughs> Listen, he might not be able to control his bladder, but you can grate cheese on his abs. It's absolutely ridiculous. Here, Dad, did you need something for all that blood? You, you could just... Perfect. <laughs> I mean, I, I, you gotta appreciate the fact that my grandpa is practically Master Roshi. Is it time for art lessons with the hobos now? Can you please pay any attention to your son? Or could one of you maybe doodle on this? I, I don't care what, if, if it ends up... Being a picture of my dad doing the suck it motion, that's fine. Just turn it into anything other than a miserable failure. That's different. I, I don't remember us having swords and armor in the house. Then again, it is a big house, I suppose. Can I give that to you? Oh, oh okay. I, I forgot for a second I cut my dad in half. Here, here, uh, co cover up your shame. Yeah, yeah, mom. You totally okay with two random men drawing your husband naked? Man, oh man, I, I, I just give up on this family dynamic. It doesn't make sense. I really didn't think I was gonna be begging a hobo not to jerk off to my extra thick poster today, but here I am. Unless you do wanna jerk off and could use this. No, wishful thinking again, okay. Got another extra thick poster over here. And a bra? Maybe I can give this to you and get your motor running and then get you to make a mess of my test? No. What am I supposed to do with this thing then? Okay. <laughs> oh! <laughs> For some reason, he thought the poster had three dimensional boobs, but it was just me farting in his face. Would you like this now? No. Uh, oh, there's also a phone here. How about I use that to call paramedics? Why don't I just call the police? He's clearly trespassing. Oh, you need something to write on, sir? Here you go. You, you, you can take that and be on your way. Don't worry, mom. I got rid of the hobos and you're only short one bra. <laughs> Stupid butt bra is so good. Well, we managed to find our way outside, which can only mean one thing. Beefcake and Dad. Beefcake, I don't suppose you would like to finally eat my test for the love of God. Like, you eat literally everything but the things that I want you to eat. It doesn't make any sense. You're clearly not watching your microwave physique. <laughs> Just help me out. I could try hiding it in here. I don't think that's a good idea, though. I'm willing to bet that mom is not afraid of beefcake. Everybody is afraid of mom and she would look in there. We've also got uh, a broken frisbee that I can't interact with for some reason. Am I missing something? 
can I use this to repair the frisbee? If I can tear it up and use it as paper mache, why don't I just stick it to the bottom of a table? Or better yet, throw it over the fence or something. I can probably throw it over the fence now. There we go. Beefcake, you're gonna eat that, right? Don't give it to mom. Don't give it to mom. Beefcake, you Judas, come on. You're supposed to be man's best friend. Well, it definitely feels like I'm supposed to fix the Frisbee, but I'm not supposed to use it with Beefcake. Maybe dad is really bad at catching. If I throw it to him, it'll end up over the ball. Or maybe he's got his shotgun up his pants and <laughs> he's just ready and rearing for somebody to throw up a target. Thanks, Dad. Neighbors must hate us. After a long, hard afternoon of scattering plastic shrapnel all over the neighbor's lawn, it looks like Dad has eaten himself into a partial food coma. I don't suppose you'd be in a good mood and willing to sign off on that. No, never, of course. Oh, no, Grandma. She's hurting for certain. Can I help her a little bit? Yeah, yeah, I actually like Grandma. She's on my side. <laughs> she gave me a nickel. All right, that's something, I suppose. We've got some rope here as well, which I tied to the nickel. Okay, interesting. And I've got some ketchup. What am I gonna use a nickel and ketchup for? Oh, I see, Dad, go to sleep. Yeah, just enter that coma and then hide this, maybe? Would you like a little ketchup as if you were murdered? <laughs> Maybe mom will be a little bit too concerned to check what's in his hand. Yeah! <laughs> okay, they'll get over the fact that he's dead and then hopefully not find the test. I I'm consoling grandma, she'll be fine. After having your death baked for you, nothing is quite as relaxing as traveling to flavor country. <laughs> yeah, you keep smoking there, dad. I'm gonna go over here and find some unattended gasoline. That might be an interesting mix with your recreational activities. I don't suppose I could... I don't really want to blow you up, though. I, I kind of want to get rid of the test. How am I going to manage to do that? I can't combine items easily. There are also plants that look like they need to be watered, but I don't think they want to be watered with gas. Can I just... Uh, Piss on them? Okay. I was gonna say pick them, but yeah, pissing on them and then picking them works, I suppose. <laughs> I am so confused right now. So you don't want the gas. You don't want me to blow you up. Do you want a rose? Just give that to you and then you can seduce mom's anger away. What was the point of the gasoline then? Do you guys want to take a look at this now? You oh, you don't care. Of course you don't care, you're about to get a deep dick in. <gasps> I can't believe the smoking in the gasoline was a red herring and now my baby brother is gonna sniff it. Uh, not my problem, it's their problem, they're the adults. Oh no, I've never seen Beefcake this sad before. He's normally such a happy little chunky thing. His stomach is rumbling, which means he finally might eat my evidence. Okay, fine, starve to death, see if I care. I've got a battery pack. I don't know what dad's been using that for. We don't have a car. I only assume that the... I swear to God, if they have the jumper cables in the bedroom, that is just as weird as having a plastic bag chicken grow on the lawn. All right. Uh, beefcake, I don't think I should electrocute you or feed you raw chicken, so... I'm gonna try to cook the chicken in the... Ooh, is that stupid? Uh, let me rephrase that. That is stupid, but it worked. <laughs> so now we've got ourselves a chicken. I mean, I, I obviously want to feed the dog, sure. I, I don't want him to die, but at the same time, my objective is to get rid of the evidence and you're not helping Beefcake. You're just making more problems, okay? If I hide this in there, Mom's clearly gonna see it. Question is, will she risk it? Nope. <laughs> and you know what? I can't blame her. Oh, cool. Yeah, Dad, you keep playing Yu-Gi-Oh with the hobos. I'll just be over here you know, being neglected. Don't mind me. 
<laughs> Maybe I can keep pecking through your Donkey Kong erotica collection. Interesting. Hold on to that for later, I would imagine. I uh, also have a charging cable. I saw that this needed to be plugged in. Uh, oh no, it, it's a DVD. Okay, so you guys can all go over there and then I can play cards or, or hide this. She's gonna find that. She's gonna find that in a heartbeat. No, she, she's a little bit pissed off with the weird circle jerk that's happening in the living room. <laughs> Reasonable. Well, it looks like Dad got himself a brand new TV. I can't wait to never see it again in this giant black hole of a house. <laughs> oh yeah, the old TV was broken. So maybe I can hide my test in it, and then when it gets taken out to the dump, I'll be rid of the evidence. Or not. I, I, I guess the screen cracked when Mom tried to hide her fat ass behind it. Good idea going with a wall-mounted flat screen this time, Dad. You know Mom all too well. <laughs> so I can get myself, oh, a bar of soap. I was gonna say I get myself a bucket. So maybe Dad won't end up with the TV after all. Oh no, it looks fine. I kind of figured he was gonna smash it or something. So should I install this for you? Uh, maybe I can hide it behind there. Don't look. Yeah, sh she's not concerned with the fact that, again, Dad is unconscious on the floor, but she's like, I don't see any test, not smelling anything. I, I guess it's just new TV smell. Grandpa, what you doing out here? I've said it before and I'll say it again. I'm all for your feats of strength, but you really shouldn't be wearing white. It, it, it's hard to get the pee stains out. <laughs> Do you want me to stack up stuff for you? I think that's metal or stone, so, oh, doesn't matter. Oh, okay, I hurt Grandpa and that's bad. All right then, I guess that random piece of material that's right next to you doesn't actually have anything to do with you? Did it just fall from the sky? Did aliens deposit it here? I really don't understand. What the Christ is happening in this lawn? Like, Dad, why did you cut down the one tree here? I, I know the house looks like a friggin' roller derby rink, so you and Mom are all about the minimalism, but still. <laughs> this seems a little bit excessive. I got some No Choppies beer. D did you want to drink? You look kind of warm. Or maybe you'd like to wipe your heads with my tests? No? Also got the chainsaw. Oh, maybe I need to make Grandpa some wood and not let him chop the bottle? That looks a little excessive though. I've seen Grandpa's muscles, but still, maybe we can actually make planks? Yeah, there we go, okay, so... I don't think we want to use this. I think we want to use this. And, oh, okay, I'll get you to chop the test in half. I was gonna say, how is that helping me at all, but... No evidence. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 Okay, if you're gonna hurt yourself, do it on your own time. I don't want to be part of this. Oh, right, I was already being replaced in this family. Uh, it's so rare for me to leave the house beyond the backyard that I completely forgot about my little nerdy chubby replacement who's currently playing with a kite next to live power wires. I'm just gonna let natural selection take its course. I'll, I'll sit back, get myself a drink, get ready to watch the fireworks one good gust of wind and you're gonna be completely toasted. Actually, you're thirsty, aren't you? So I can give that to you. And then, still kind of waiting for that wind. Do I need to give you a nudge? No, I can take the kite. And you can cry. I don't know if I should be the one playing with the kite by the power lines. That seems like a mistake. Uh, oh, okay. That's not what I was planning. But if we've set up a trap to literally kill mom, that works seems excessive but permanent of course we wouldn't be so lucky as to have her just drop dead <laughs> i gotta get out of here okay enough is enough you never know when you're gonna have a strange man show up at the door with the a test who is that is that my stepdad that wasn't dad is his mom seeing someone on the side oh you're probably my teacher Okay, so am I playing as 
you now? I would imagine that I'm hiding behind the poster, not in the bed, of course. <laughs> After 60 levels, I know myself all too well. Behind a door? No, too easy. Behind another door? No, he's in the fridge. You got, gotta be in the fridge. <laughs> all right. Mom is ratting me out, is she? In there. What are you sweating about, kid? Something doesn't add up. I don't trust the door. You sure that, uh, your mom? I thought so. <laughs> All right. Yeah, you better ask for forgiveness. The teacher is pissed and I'm getting the hell out of here. This is abusive household. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> is that the whole game? I'm going to miss this. But you know what I think? That's gonna be it for Hide My Test, guys. I gotta say, this has been probably the best strange Japanese mobile game that I've played since Hidden My Game by Mom. You guys seem to really enjoy this. I really enjoyed it, so I'm sad to see it go. But if you know of any more of these games, be sure to leave a like in the video, leave a comment letting me know, and maybe I'll return to play more of them again soon. But thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.